Greetings everyone and welcome to the Mandela Effect. Sorry, I have a new phone, just trying to make sure it's recording. So anyway, greetings everyone and welcome welcome to the Mandela Effect. Has the Mona Lisa looked a little bit different for you? I don't know. I want to, I, I don't know how many people have seen the Mona Lisa. It's revered as one of the most famous paintings ever. I personally have the honor and the privilege of being in France at the Louvre, and I have seen the Mona Lisa in person. Now, I'm not trying to tell anyone that the Mona Lisa has changed, because if you know who I am, my name is Byron Preston, and basically nothing has changed here. A group of people got moved from another earth and they are here and they have their memories from the other earth that is all there is a sister solar system a sister earth a mere earth and it has to do with singularity and um how every particle uh, you know adam has a twin and and i really don't want to go into that right now so I'm not trying to tell you anything's changed. It's just some of us might have a memory of a different Mona Lisa. For example, my Mona Lisa did not smile. Her face, well, just take this in for a moment. This is straight from the Louvre in Paris. This is an original on a computer, as it can be, of the Mona Lisa. In real life, the Mona Lisa is actually a very small painting. And the thing is, it, everyone, uh, uh, you know, it, it's like, how come Mona Lisa didn't smile? That, that's, that was the talk on the old earth. Everyone talked about, how come Mona Lisa doesn't smile? Why doesn't she smile? I mean, she's being painted by one of the most famous artists of all time. And, you know, there's all these, you know, stories and backstories and... You know, if you want to call it conspiracy theories about why Mona Lisa never spot, smiled. Uh, it, it, it's like a revered topic on the old earth. But here, lo and behold, look. She has a smirk. I'm not going to call this a smile. I think a smile is going a little too far. So I'm not going to sit here and tell you she's smiling. But... She has a smirk. Look at that. The lips go up a little bit. You can see the dimple. You can see the shadow. I mean, he's portraying light. You know, you can see the shadow. And you, you can see the shadow here, the indentation. And she, you can see the lip moving forward. And you can see a shadow under the lip now. So, this shadow, these shadows do not exist on the Mona Lisa from my earth. Um... She is clearly um, having a different muscular structure, which makes her lips move differently and creates different shadows. And this is, um, and you look at the eyebrows. Yeah, there's some differences here. I'm not going to go into all that. But if you look at her whole demeanor, if you are from my old earth, then you know what I'm talking about. If you're a native, then you've probably written me 10,000 nasty comments by now. God bless you. Wish you well. But um, this, this video is for people who remember the Mona Lisa from, you know, the old earth, my earth. And she looks completely different. This is one of the most famous paintings in my old earth earth and i assume you're too i mean this is like the most famous painting ever so if you want to sit there and say we have bad memories about the most famous painting of all history well i'm sorry knock yourself out but we we, we know we have our memories we, we we know we know anyway god bless you Good night, everyone. Peace be with you.